My name is William Heron, astronomer, historian, and seeker of truth. Since first arriving on Aeternum, my fascination has been this mysterious land and the various people who have at one point or another ruled over it. The ruins that cover this island are clear evidence of an ancient race who built a magnificent civilization that existed long before any human set foot upon these shores. Where they came from, I have yet to discover. The ancients harnessed the power of Azoth, using it to perform their miracles and extend their lives. But perhaps the use of this great power came at a catastrophic price. There are clues within the ruins of a terrible conflict having taken place at some point during the reign of the ancients. I believe that the guardians that roam these lands and protect the sacred sites of the ancients were the foot soldiers in this conflict. Since corruption infests many parts of Eternum, I conclude that the ancients did not emerge victorious. Further, since the ancients have disappeared, I am left to wonder if they survived at all. Today, we only know the ancients by the things they left behind. Monuments to their lost culture can be found across all of Eternum, sparking fascination in scholars. Less welcome are the legions of formidable guardians that still maintain their vigil. Guardians exist in perpetual servitude to their lost masters. Adorned with ancient armor and wielding deadly weapons, they defend the ruins, temples, and monuments the ancients left behind. While they may appear to be soulless members of the lost, these magical warriors are actually much more deadly relentlessly defending their master's secrets even though their masters are long gone. Appearing as living skeletons, guardians stoically patrol important ancient sites, responding to any perceived threat with ceaseless violence. These warriors will not tire nor rest. The only way to stop them is to destroy the pulsing stone sphere housed within their chest. This nucleus of Azoth acts as the Guardian's heart. Destroy it, and you will destroy the Guardian. In my studies, I have pinpointed certain sites where ancient Guardians are known to appear. I have not found a definitive pattern for all locations they patrol, except to say that they inevitably appear in any location that was deemed of importance to the ancients. One such place is Rickwater, this boggy swamp is said to be the original birthplace of the Guardians, where the ancients first transformed humans into their restless soldiers through unnatural rituals performed within the Pool of Eternity. It is said that those who delve into the Lazarus Well expedition will come face to face with one of the most fearsome Guardians that ever existed. Little is known about this creature, as few have survived encounters with it. Another mysterious monument lies in the plains of Morningdale. Here you can find one of the most well-preserved ancient temples in all of Eternum, lying untouched among the ruins of a city. What secrets could lie inside? I could only hope that I can uncover the secrets myself. In the heart of Eternum, you will find the lush land of Everfall and the shattered obelisk, a perplexing relic of the ancient civilization. Some believe this mysterious artifact holds the secret to the ancient's technology and the purpose of the many towers scattered across the region. Be on your guard when exploring this location, for it is known to be well defended. There is still so much we don't know about the ancients. Where did they come from? How did they build the awesome structures that can be found across Aeternum? And will they return to reclaim their land? It is up to you to find out.